Hi guys, hope you're all okay. It's Chantelle. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a video on amazing, affordable fragrances that everyone should at least try. These are all unisex fragrances in my opinion and the quality is amazing for the price of these fragrances so before we get into that if you haven't already subscribed to my channel i'd absolutely love it if you would do that it really really helps the channel out and helps it grow and also let me know in the comments what's your favorite affordable fragrance i love chatting with you all and i always always reply to everyone's comments so let's get straight into chatting about the fragrances. The first fragrance that I love and would highly, highly recommend everyone to check out is Dupe Le Ban. Now this has been out since 1989 and I don't think this gets enough hype. It's a really amazing fragrance. It smells really clean and warm. It's got a softness about it. It's comforting. It just smells like a really sort of spa-like, luxurious bath. It's beautiful. Definitely one I would pick up on like a night time because I find it super relaxing. It's comforting. It's cosy. It's just beautiful there's vanilla in there you get quite a lot of amber and like the powderiness it's stunning real really beautiful i love it so much both me and my husband wear this one and we both really enjoy it so yeah a real gem this one guys definitely check this one out if you haven't already so the next fragrance is quite a new fragrance. It came out last year in 2020. It's by Pascal Morabito and it's called Sultan Noir. Now, honestly, when this came through the post, I couldn't believe what I was smelling. The quality of this fragrance is unreal for the price. It's a true beauty. It's spicy. It's sort of a bit smoky. It's got like a warmness to it. It's beautiful. It really, really is. This one's got some spicy notes in there. I think there's cinnamon, there's vanilla, there's leather, there's a bit of oud in there. You get quite a bit of incense and there's also an apple note, which I really get in the opening. This is beautiful it really is definitely an autumn and winter fragrance and i'll get so much wear out of this on cold days i love it i definitely think this one leans a little bit more masculine still unisex but a little bit more masculine but for me i think this is amazing and the lasting power is unbelievable I got 10 plus hours from it. It really, really clings to the skin. It projects really nicely as well. Such a hidden gem. Definitely check this out if you like the sound of the note. It's a real, real good one. And it's called Sultan Noir. Then we've got Ebony Wood. Now this is from the Zara Collection. I think it's the Emotions Collection, which was done with Jo Malone. This is a beautiful woody fragrance. It's a little bit spicy and it's got clove in there. You've also got like a pink pepper note. It's a beautiful fragrance. Definitely, definitely unisex. I get like a slight booziness from this one. I just think it's really nice. I've heard a lot of people talking about the collection and this really seems to be the standout fragrance. It's very affordable and it does have sort of a niche quality to it. And I really enjoy this one. This one came out in 2019 and I think it's been a really good seller for Zara. The only downside is 
it doesn't last quite as long as i'd like it to i got i'd say around four hours from it which i suppose isn't too bad if you don't mind topping your fragrance up so yeah it's still a good one and it's such an affordable price ebony wood by zara the next one that i want to show you is by banana republic it's dark cherry and amber and this pretty much smells exactly that it's a beautiful sort of syrupy cherry fragrance you get the amber in there as well i think there's like a praline note in there and also a hint of woodiness but to me it's got like a sort of boozy element to it it's like a sort of boozy cherry cordial but i really really like it again the lasting power isn't amazing but for what you're paying this fragrance smells beautiful again it's got that niche vibe to it and i think it's a really good one this one was released in 2019 and i really really enjoy it so yeah definitely recommend dark cherry and amber an amazing affordable unisex fragrance the next one is very recent to my collection i'm not sure when this one was released but it's by h&m and it's called above the clouds this is a really sort of clean fresh laundry sort of smelling fragrance if you like just smelling clean you'd love this one i really really enjoy this i've been wearing this quite a bit since i got it it's amazing because i'm not going out at all really we're sitting in the house and i just think this is such an easy reach it just smells as i say clean and fresh and it's non-offensive it honestly just smells like clean cotton and i'm loving it so yeah that's another good one and it's very very affordable so yeah above the clouds by h&m definitely unisex as well and the final fragrance i want to show you is actually a fragrance oil and it's by al Haramain and it's called de Harb. now this is a beautiful caramel and vanilla fragrance that's mainly what i get from it it's stunning i find this amazing for layering you could pretty much put nearly any fragrance on top of this one and it would smell amazing and it definitely definitely makes your fragrances last that bit longer when you apply an oil underneath so if you're looking for a really affordable gourmand fragrance this is so so good i just think it smells really expensive for what it is honestly i think i only paid i think it was under five pound for this oil and it's a true beauty i really love it so if you love vanilla scents as much as i do this is an amazing one so that's it guys those are the fragrances i would really really recommend i'd like to thank you all so so much for your continued support and watching and commenting on all my videos if you're not already subscribed i'd love it if you would do so give us a big thumbs up if you like the video and don't forget to comment i love chatting with you all so much and i'll see you all very very soon on the next one bye